All right, guys, we have the new track editor in MXGP 2020. Uh, this is the elevation that they were talking about. At the beginning, you could see when you put down the start, you have pre-made trees and stuff like that on the map already. And it just kind of, you put the start over it. And then the, the pre-made stuff just kind of forms around it. You know what I mean? Now here, I tried to cut this video up so it wasn't super long and boring. Where you just saw me messing around trying to figure everything out. Uh, basically, I'm trying to show you how the elevation works. So, from what I understand, the elevation is in the map. Okay, I, I thought that we were going to be able to raise the elevation. I mean, that, that might be asking a bit much, but that's kind of what I was thinking. That's kind of what I was thinking it was going to be, but it really isn't. And I, I mean, I haven't played with the track editor very much, just a, just a very small amount, but it seems that the map has pre-made hills on it. Okay, so uh, pretty small hills, but you'll see when I test the track that it actually works really, really good, and it is pretty sweet. I would say this track editor is already way better than 2019. I was never a big fan of the track editor in MXGP 2019. I just didn't like it. I don't know. I felt like it was super basic and not very good. But this one, the track editor, the pieces are very similar to 2019, but you can turn them around. I think they probably did give us a few different pieces, but it is very similar and it forms to the hill, right? So you probably have seen in the video, I, I made sure to show it a bit, but the like the pre-made dragon's back thing, it, it just, you know what it looks like when you put it down normally, but here if you put it on the, the, the hill, it stretches out and kind of forms it differently. So uh, it is pretty sweet. Now, from what I can see, you can't really go back and adjust if you mess up early. Okay, so off the start, I tried to make uh, a big step up double, but it didn't work. And I can't figure out how to go back and edit that section. So that's unfortunate. I really hope they they can patch that in eventually because people mess up. People want to change stuff, you know? So I don't know. Right now it feels like you can't go back and edit a section. So what I would recommend is test. Test often. Make sure it works before you do it because you'll have to delete a bunch of sections, a bunch of parts if you want to if you want to change it. So uh, for right now, you can't. You can turn the sections around, which is great. We have a decent amount of options and the jumps are very rolled off like they were in 2019, but it doesn't bother me as much because with the with the elevation here, you can do some pretty sweet stuff. Now, I didn't actually try this track. I did not try the track out. Just uh, going with the flow, hoping it would work, you know, so I'm shocked. It works as good as it does. I really am. This section here is the part I was talking about that I wasn't a big fan of. I was hoping to be able to be a, a big step up a double, but it, it just didn't work. Uh, it's really easy to loop out on that jump too. So I wish I could change that, but I can't figure out how to go back. Uh, that section works okay. But the, the cool stuff is, is coming up here at the end. So we can't quite step up to that. I was hoping to be able to step up all the way over, but it kind of worked to, to double off of it a bit, a bit uh, wonky, but it, it does work. This is sweet. This step uh, down double, we hit it just about right. Oh my gosh, that is so smooth, man. That is super awesome. So if you take your time and, and really work on it and try to incorporate the, the hillside, you can do some pretty sweet stuff. I'm really excited to see your guys' tracks and what you guys come up with. 
Now I am playing it on PC. I do have it on Xbox. I did check there. It doesn't seem to be, the track editor doesn't seem to be on Xbox yet. I don't know when Xbox updates stuff. Maybe it is already, but it is on PC. I believe it was there probably, I think it was like 2.30 central time. So uh, yes, check, check if you have it on PlayStation, Xbox, it may be there by now. If you're on PC, it definitely is. This section works a lot better if you hit it faster. I, I hadn't played it yet, so I wasn't sure exactly how I wanted to hit it. We do a lot better on the next lap. We kind of have an idea of how to hit things. So uh, really, really sweet. I just, I wish, I wish that you could go back and edit sections. Maybe I'm missing something. I, I'll make sure, but uh, you, you can't go back as easy as you normally would in, for, uh, let's say, Supercross. Uh, it just it didn't seem to be the same way. So uh, I wish you could edit sections after you put them down. And it would have been cool if there would have been a way, a very basic way to to raise the elevation ourselves, you know. So, so that that's just the the complaint I have, I guess. But overall, it is pretty sweet. It is basic, but it is pretty sweet, and it is better than 2019 for sure. Right now, we only do have one environment: the apple orchard, I believe. I think that's what this is. They said they're going to be adding the plane, the plane uh, environment, and the quarry. I believe will be coming later, not in this patch. So, uh, yeah, that that should be coming a bit later. I don't know when. Uh, just glad that we got this one. You know, it would it would have sucked if we got the plane flat environment and not and not the one with the elevation. But that's what they are advertising the game as. So it was really important that they that they got it. And and uh, you know. Hats off to, to Milestone for getting this out so fast. I really thought it was going to be next week. That's kind of what it sounded like, but they, they managed to to put the time in and get it out to us before the end of the week. So, uh, especially if you're on PC. Again, I don't know if on console it's going to be like that. Let me know in the comments if it is on console, if you happen to, to be playing it already, but for me it wasn't. Also, if you got this far, let me know in the comments on this video what your track names are for does your track suck we are going to start that i'm really excited with the new environment and to see what you guys come up with and see what i can do i'm going to do a does of my track suck this probably isn't it i should be i'm actually very 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 happy with this track minus the the step up double that doesn't work but i'll take more time you know play around with the editor a bit more and then do a does of my track suck so so if you happen to miss it on this video and don't put your track name in the comments here you'll have a second chance with uh does of my track suck because that'll be coming up relatively soon so uh yeah it's it's really good it's really good guys i you heard my two complaints if you are playing with the track editor let me know what you guys think about it are you happy with it do you feel like it's not as good as you were hoping but you guys and girls are absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for the support on the channel lately. It really does mean a lot. And until the next video, take it easy.